Andrew Tucker, and welcome to Andrew Tucker World. What's going on, all my great people? What's going on, all my boxing fans? Oh, it's gonna be a real quick video. Um, Tyson Fury is said he's ready. He's ready. Um, he's gonna start back training. Um, he's ready for the trilogy with Deontay Wilder. He's ready to fight. Um, I know a lot's been going on um, when it comes to Tyson Fury um, dealing with his his newborn baby. You know, being sick and things of that nature. I know as a parent that that's that could affect you. That really could affect really really can affect you. Um, um, and I know that weigh, uh, uh, that weighs heavy on a parent when when we have a sick child. You know. Especially a newborn baby, I know that weighs that weighs heavy on a parent, you know, and I know that could um, affect affect you, really affect you when you when you have a child that's sick, you know. Dealing with Tyson Fury situation, you know, I pray all is well with him and his family. I pray all is well with his newborn baby. I pray for a speedy recovery. Um, I pray that uh, the that the newborn baby is healed. Uh, I pray for strength and I pray for healing for his newborn baby you know uh, but Tyson Fury says he's, he's gonna he's gonna go back he's gonna go back training he's gonna start back training um, I believe I really believe he really wants this fight with Deontay Wilder I believe both fighters really wants this fight really want this fight and it's gonna be a good fight you know it's gonna be a good fight uh, so I, uh, good news. Um, good news. After baby daughter scare, Tyson Fury says he hopes to begin training for a third Wilder fight today. Um, it also goes on to say even before a heavyweight champion, Tyson Fury had to go through the simply unimaginable agony of almost losing his newborn daughter. Some people were skeptical over whether or not the third fight Fury is set to have with Deontay Wilder on October the 9th would actually happen. Then, with Fury's daughter fighting for her life, Tyson's father, John, came out and stated how the fight should be postponed. As family comes first, above everything else, Fury Sr. spoke spoke of how no man can be mentally tuned in to fight a big fight with so much personal stress on their mind and I agree you know because when you when you have a child that's sick a newborn baby that's sick or a child that's sick you know that affects you mentally you know what I mean and if you and you are if you are if you don't if you're not a hundred percent mentally you're not going to, it's going to affect you physically as well you're not going to be able to be able to perform at your best when you step in the ring so I agree a hundred percent you know this situation with Tyson Fury and his daughter is is far more important than you know of uh, fighting taking I mean fighting and stepping in the ring you want to make sure you are ready and you are prepared but you want to make sure your family is taken care of first you want to make sure everything is okay with your family. That's number one. You know, um, much love and respect to both fighters. I believe it's going to be a great fight. And I believe the fight is going to happen. Um, I believe the fight is going to happen. Um, but today, and taken to social media, the recently turned 33-year-old Fury announced how he aims to be back in full training today. Fury put out a message informing fans he has been for a run and that he hopes to be able to lead the Liverpool Hospital where his daughter is still being looked after later on today. I've just finished a little run this morning getting it in. Fury wrote, still here at the hospital. Hopefully we'll be leaving today and I can start training camp I can start training camp for the big dosser. Of course, he's talking about Deontay Wilder. October the 9th is still uh, October the 9th is still some time away, a little under eight weeks. So that could give Fury just enough time to get ready. Of course, we don't know what Fury has been doing in the weeks prior to his daughter being born, and we don't know how the stress of the whole thing was has affected him. But as of now, the three match is on. The, they meant to say the third, but the, they say the three match 
is on as planned for October the 9th in Las Vegas. So much has happened since these two giants first collided. Seemingly way, <coughs> excuse me, seemingly way back in December of 2018 and the return fight of February 2020 also seems as long as it also seems a long time ago now. Who wins the third fight? On paper, Fury has to be the pretty strong pick to win. But doing what has been one odd year for the sport of boxing, pretty much anything could happen on October the 9th. For now, let's all wish Fury Daughter a full recovery. So I, I pray for I pray for a speedy recovery, uh, a full recovery. When it comes to Tyson Fury's daughter, I pray I pray him and his family, Tyson Fury and his family is in our is, is in is in my prayers and our prayers because of course my family also praying for praying for him and his and his daughter as well and his family. Um, but I believe and you know um, everything is going to be okay. You know, and uh, I believe we will get the fight October the 9th between Fury and Wilder. And I believe it's going to be a good fight. You know, um, yes, I I got, I have to be honest, Fury going to have to be, he's going to have to be ready and prepared mentally and physically. Because this time he's going in there against a very dangerous Deontay Wilder. Um, Wilder has been working, working hard, training hard. Um, uh, perfect uh, trying real hard to perfect his craft and um, I've been seeing some the, the videos the training videos not necessarily sparring but the training videos and how he's preparing for Fury and I just know that uh, this time around this fight is going to be different it's not I don't see it being like the first fight I don't see it it's not going to be a repeat of the, of, the, of the rematch I think this time these fighters are going to challenge each other it's going to be a great heavyweight showdown it's going to be a great fight and uh, we got a Wilder that's that's that's, that's uh, dangerous, a dangerous Wilder this time. Um, I believe they have gotten they have gotten better, you know. Um, and that's going to most definitely come to fight. Um, and we got a very skilled, very skilled Tyson Fury, very fundamentally sound, one of the best fighters in the world, one of the most skilled heavyweights. You know, it's going to most definitely be a great fight I favor Fury to win but it's not going to be easy and I say may the best man win I have respect for both of these fighters um, but much love and respect to Tyson Fury uh, and his family um, prayers and our prayers go out to his um, to his newborn daughter and I pray for a speedy recovery a full recovery in Jesus name Andrew Tucker Andrew Tucker World this is all I got for now uh, more live streams are coming. More videos are coming. To the UK Army, Tucker Army, much love and respect. And I'll see you guys in the next video.